Let me tell you a story. So there was a man. Let's call this man Mark Yoon. And in his efforts to stay awake after working a long day at work, waiting effortlessly for Smash Brothers to come out, trying so hard not to fall asleep before that midnight launch release. Around 11 o'clock, he puts on a stream on YouTube from the real, uh, from uh, Review Tech USA. Rich, thank you. And what did he happen upon? The Video Game Awards. The super boring, super, super annoying, super cringy Video Game Awards. God, those things were awful. But there was a silver lining. There was a speck in the sunshine. There was a fin in the water. No, that, that's a bad thing. You don't want to see a fin in the water. <laughs> well, maybe, maybe you do. If you're a marine biologist. So... Ed Boon comes with his trolling ass out into the stage <laughs> to a get announce a winner for a video game series. <coughs> Sorry about that. And what does he do? He decides to roll the reveal trailer for Mortal Kombat 11. Yes, my friends, that's what this troll did, and we will be forever grateful, and this troll will go down in effortless his history. He will be, until our dying breath, the one who gave us this trailer. Now, for those of you who saw my last video, this was leaked, and we kind of uh, knew about this. So, I said in my last video at the end that if these leaks prove true, if it is revealed at the Video Game Awards, the release date, which is April 23rd, by the way, then we will probably think the rest of the, the rumors are going to be true. Now, I'm going to be playing the trailer in the background so you guys can see it. Um, obviously for copyright reasons I've taken out the music and so um, I will provide a link to the actual reveal trailer on uh, down in my description box and sorry if I'm a little not with it this morning I've stayed up till probably I don't know 8 a.m. playing smash and I'm literally just making this video so that my subscribers who didn't see the vi um, video game awards last night uh, can see it and understand it so as you can see from the trailer, we have, um, you know, Scorpion fighting Raiden. So it's a pretty short, like, CG trailer, no gameplay. But um, what comes with that is a lot of information that was revealed from the leaks. So if that's to be true, then we're going to be getting two story modes. We're going to have uh, create a character. We're going to have character customization for the main cast. We're going to have um, the second story being an adventure mode, kind of like Shaolin Monks with drop-in, drop-out co-op mode. We are going to have hours of fun with this game. Um, this is shaping up to be the, the best Mortal Kombat that I've ever witnessed. The, the graphics look beautiful in the CG trailer, and I'm not sure if that's how it's going to look, because it's going to come out probably, it's going to come out for PS4 and Xbox One. Um, I'm sure if you have a Pro or an X, it's going to be better. Possibly PC as well. But... You know how they roll now, and they're probably going to... PlayStation 5 is slotted to come out between uh, March and August of 2020. So what they're probably going to do is all the DLC is going to come out, and then I'll probably make an Ultimate Edition that's like higher resolution, be the um, one of the launch titles for the PlayStation 4, I mean for the 5, and the uh, whatever Project Scarlet's going to be called. Um... <laughs> yeah, I mean, we saw that with um, Injustice. We saw that with um, Mortal Kombat Nine. Like, they're they're just like they. Uh, it's gonna come out this generation. So it's the, the they didn't have a year at the end of the reveal, and a lot of people were worried about that. But I believe it's gonna be August twenty third, twenty nineteen. It's gonna be here, and uh, all the rumors and speculation can be put aside from the release. That's the official release, and. I'm super hyped. Like, I was talking to my buddies last night while I was walking to uh, GameStop for the Smash um, Midnight, and whew, I was I was so incredibly blown away that, I mean, we ex I expected a trailer, but, like, so many times these rumors have been wrong, and I almost have wanted it to be wrong, if that sounds weird, because I wanted to have it its own, like, reveal thing and not be, it like... <sighs> It was literally the only thing interesting about the Video Game Awards. The Video Game Awards were incredibly boring. They brought out, like, the Red Dead country music, like, choir or whatever you want to call them. And, yeah, the music sounded good, but it was even more so putting me to sleep. 
if you like that stuff, then that's like good for you. That's not, um, I'm not hating on it, but it's just like not my cup of tea. But Mortal Kombat is. And um, be sure to check out my last video. I'll have a link to it at the end of this video in the end card, so be sure to stay till the end. Um, it's going to um, go over all of the leaks in detail so you know exactly what's going to be coming out with this game. And I'll also post a card up here for the description of the trailer that um, my friend Ariel uh, actually provided me with. So thank you, Ariel. And um, I credited him in the, the screenshot, obviously. He sent it to me over PSN. So we have a description for it, and it talks about the character customization. Um, I still believe that even though Character Creator wasn't mentioned, that Character Creator is going to be a part of it, and we are going to be able to create our own characters just like Armageddon, uh, but the character customization is also mentioned 100%, and that's probably going to be similar to what it was in Injustice 2, but probably obviously revamped. Um, and let's hope that now that Mortal Kombat 11 is coming out, if we do get a guest character, it's freaking Spawn, because... Tom McFarlane likes to uh, play wet and loose with like who he lets use his licenses. And um, we obviously know from Injustice 2 that he didn't come out, but he also said that he's more in line with a horror character and he would much rather have uh, Mortal Kombat have Spawn than um, Injustice, which is weird to me because you put Spawn in Soul Calibur, dude. So, <laughs> I mean, whatever. I'm not here to judge the man, but hopefully we get spawn if we're going to have any guest characters is it a bad idea if we have no guest characters no because if we have create a character we can make whoever the hell we want so who cares but uh, i'm not going to stretch this video out to 10 minutes just so i can uh <laughs> have it pick up more traction uh please like and share the video guys if you um want this news to get out there even though it's probably permeated the internet by now and i'm probably late to the party because i couldn't wait to get my hands on smash <laughs> so with that being said, guys, we're going to bring this video to an end. Please be sure to check out my friend Rich at Ragaroth Enterprises. You can find a link to his channel in the description box below, as long as everything we talked about today. The music also, all that good stuff. And as always, guys, stay powered up. Peace.